now we do want to go back to WVTM 13's Aaron Llewellyn following the latest on this homicide investigation. Yeah, Jarvis, so we are here on First Avenue that is near East Lake Park. Now, what we know is that one man is dead tonight and two others are in the hospital fighting for their lives. That is a man and a woman that are in the hospital fighting for their lives tonight after police say that a shootout happened in this area. So I'm going to step out the way so I can give you a look at how big this scene is. It is a very large scene as police are still investigating what happened tonight. So what we know is that shot spotter alerted police around 740 of multiple shots fired. They counted about 50, but there could be more as police police are still investigating now here in the roadway that you can see there were two vehicles that were involved in an accident near East Lake Park now, officers got to a third vehicle that was inside the park after they believed that that vehicle drove through the fence at the park now when they got there they found one man already dead inside the vehicle and two others who had made it outside of the vehicle who had been shot now that man and that woman that were shot and were outside of the vehicle were taken to hospitals again where they are fighting for their lives now the shootout happened between who what police believe were multiple people that were in these cars and they say that they also found several guns near the cars and inside the cars and they also believe that every person in those cars was involved in the shooting now again there was an accident that happened in the roadway here police don't believe that 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 those cars were involved in the shooting they say that the person who was driving one of those vehicles was trying to get away from the shots being fired and ended up causing an accident now again police are still investigating and they say that this they are going to be out here for quite some time processing the scene looking at exactly what happened but as we continue to give you those or get those updates from here on first avenue near east lake park we will bring them to you but they say that this is a very large scene so there are a lot of areas that are blocked off here and they will be for quite some time and they say that no one has been arrested yet and they are still looking for multiple people because a lot of those vehicles that they found here on the scene did not have anybody in them as they believe that they got away from the scene before police got here but again we will keep you updated as we get those updates from police but for now we're live in Birmingham Aaron Llewellyn WVTM 13.